Hello everyone, I am Dr. Arun Sharma. In this video, I will explain about the main difference between Zeeman effect and Stark effect. Zeeman effect and Stark effect are two concepts in chemistry that were discovered by scientists in late 1900s. The Zeeman effect and Stark effect can be observed regarding the atomic spectra of an atom. Atomic spectra can be either absorption spectra or emission spectra. When energy is given to atoms, the atoms become excited and electrons move to higher energy levels by absorbing this energy. This absorption gives the absorption spectra. However, since a higher energy level is not stable, these electrons fall back to the ground energy level, releasing the absorbed energy as radiation. This results in emission spectra. The main difference between Zeeman effect and star effect is that Zeeman effect is observed in the presence of an external magnetic field, whereas Stark effect is observed in the presence of an external electrical field. First we discuss about the Zeeman effect. Zeeman effect is named after the Dutch scientist Peter Zeeman who have pro had proposed this effect in 1902. According to this effect, splitting of a spectrum line into several components by the application of a magnetic field. This is the representation of the Zeeman effect for the hydrogen molecule. An atomic spectrum in the is the spectrum of frequencies of electromagnetic radiation emitted or absorbed during transitions of electrons between energy levels within an atom. Emissions led to emission spectra and absorption leads to absorption spectra. This spectrum is a characteristic property of elements. The spectrum is composed of a collection of spectral lines for each and every emission or absorption. Each and every spectral line stands for this energy difference between two energy levels of the atom. Peter G. Mann observed that these spectral lines undergo splitting when the atom is kept in the presence of an external magnetic field. Zeeman effect is the result of the interaction between the magnetic moment of the atom and the external magnetic field. In this image, the atomic emission spectra for hydrogen is shows. When energy is given to a hydrogen atom, the electrons which are present at the ground state can absorb energy and move to a higher energy level. But a higher energy level is an unstable state for an atom. Therefore, the electron comes back to a lower energy level, releasing the absorbed energy. This gives an emission spectral line. But when this is studied under applied magnetic field, there we can see three spectral lines instead of one. This is the G man effect. Now we will discuss about Stark effect. Stark effect is proposed by John Stark in 1919. According to this effect, splitting of a spectrum line into several components by the application of a electrical field. So this effect was first discovered by the German scientist Johannes Stark and this effect was named after him. In this effect, it may all, this may effect also include both shifting and splitting of spectral lines. The electric field first polarizes the atom and then interacts with the resulting dipole moment. So this is the star effect in hydrogen atom and in this effect as I have told that it if, if, if this effect includes both shifting and splitting of spectral lines and 
the atom polarizes first and then interacts with the resulting dipole moment to give the Stark effect. What is the basic difference between the Zeeman effect and Stark effect? Zeeman effect describes the splitting of the spectral line of an atom in the presence of a strong magnetic field. In, but in case of Stark effect, that is the splitting of spectral lines that observed when the radiating atoms, ions or molecules are subjected to a strong electrical field. Zeeman effect can be observed in an applied magnetic field, but the Stark effect can be observed in an applied electrical field. Zeeman effect result of the interaction between the magnetic moment of the atom and the external magnetic field and the Stark effect arises due to the interaction between the electric moment of the atom and the external electrical field. So this is the basic difference between the Zeeman effect and the Stark effect. Please subscribe this channel for more videos. If you have any questions, please free to contact me. Thank you very much.